Iran's security forces have foiled a high-stakes terrorist plot poised to unleash simultaneous attacks in Tehran, the vibrant heart of the nation. In a meticulously executed operation, Iranian intelligence agencies apprehended 28 individuals linked to the notorious Islamic State, also known as ISIL or Daesh. The cherry on top? They successfully neutralized a whopping 30 explosive devices cunningly hidden in densely populated areas. The intelligence ministry's statement reads like a gripping thriller novel, unveiling a web of connections and a sinister agenda. Some of the suspects had ties to ISIL and a history intertwined with extremist organizations operating across Pakistan, Syria, Afghanistan, and the tumultuous Kurdistan region of Iraq. But what's the real story behind these explosives? The plot had multiple layers. It aimed to shake Iran's security foundations, painting a deceptive picture of instability, sowing seeds of fear and disillusionment among the populace, and igniting chaos. The diabolical twist? The attacks were meticulously timed to coincide with the anniversary of last year's anti-regime protests, triggered by the tragic death of Masa Amini due to a hijab-related incident. The stakes couldn't be higher. The explosions were set to detonate on the very anniversary of the previous year's riots, a calculated move to shake the nation's security apparatus and project an unsettling image, inducing despair and fear, and sparking further unrest and protests. Imagine a well-coordinated operation sweeping across provinces Tehran, Alborz, and West Azerbaijan like a masterful chess game. It resulted in the apprehension of 28 members of this sinister terrorist network. But that's not all. The icing on the cake was the seizure of a treasure trove of weaponry and gear, including explosives, an arsenal of bombs, and high-tech electronic devices for crafting time bombs. Hold onto your seats, there's more. Among the confiscated items were 17 American handguns brimming with ammunition, a dazzling array of smart communication devices, and military attire that could rival any action movie. Suicide vests, modems used in the Kurdistan region of Iraq, and even foreign currencies added to the entry. But amidst all the action, one heart-pounding moment unfolded during a raid at a residential hideout. The terrorists attempted a suicide attack, endangering the lives of innocent nearby residents. It was a race against time as Iranian intelligence personnel displayed unwavering bravery, diffusing the situation. The cost? Two of these heroes were injured in the line of duty. The backdrop to this thriller is a series of past attacks by ISIL on Iranian soil, including a chilling twin bombing in 2017 that targeted Iran's parliament and the mausoleum of Ayatollah Ruhollah Khomeini, the visionary founder of the Islamic Republic. Fast forward to last year, and ISIL claimed responsibility for an attack on a Shia shrine in Shiraz, resulting in the tragic loss of 15 lives. Iran, with its Shia majority, remains a prime target for ISIL's nefarious designs, as this terrorist group continues its relentless campaign against Shia Muslims. The plot thickens, but so does Iran's resilience.